Hello all! Before we get started, if you like this video, please subscribe to me. I would love you to subscribe. Thank you. Top five. A lovely, lovely YouTuber called Zincat, who has his own lovely channel, he suggested that I do the top five challenges of being an actor. And you know I like to keep it real. So I will be keeping it real. It's your dream, but reality is different. This is kind of always the case, I guess, with a lot of people's jobs that they do. You go and see shows, you go and watch TV, you go and watch films, and it all looks really glamorous. But of course, the reality is always quite different. It's not always quite as glamorous. There are glamorous times when you go to parties and, and things, but even those aren't quite as glamorous as you think they would be. It feels like I'm gonna be complaining an awful lot. But the reality is different. Your product is you. It's all about you. It's all focused on you. People in auditions looking at you and judging you. You judge yourself for your appearance and how you look and how you speak and how you act. And it's just all about you. It's not about making something for somebody else, like a shiny new toy or writing up a report. It's just about you being you. And that can be quite a lot of pressure, I guess. <coughs> You are only as good as your last audition. And I mean this even when you're working. Like, even when I was doing Les Mis, I was only as good as that audition for Les Mis. And when you leave a job, you have to start all over again. And if you go in and an audition and you're not feeling great or you just muff it up, that's it. You won't get the job. I mean, sometimes, you know, with Les Mis, like I've done it before so they knew me. But even so, I had to go and audition and I had to nail it. It's all about that five, ten minutes when you're in that room. Again, that can put quite a lot of pressure on people. It's actually a lot about pressure. Pressure is tough, isn't it? <coughs> Being out of work. The majority, I would probably say, I mean, it must be like 98% of actors. You are out of work quite a lot. Like, I'm out of work as far as an acting job goes at the moment. So what happens is, is you're working and you earn okay money, not probably as good as a lot of people think, and then you finish the job and you have to find another job. Only only a small percentage of people go from job to 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 job. So you start having to use the money that you've saved from your last job. The number of times that I've used my credit card to live after I've been working because I needed to. That is something that people don't really know about. A lot of actors are out of work for a lot of time. Last year, you know this, you guys that have been following me from right from the start, I was out of work for eight months last year. And then I got lovely jobs, which was awesome and made it all better. But it's really hard when you're out of work. <coughs> the highs are high, but the lows are really low. It's such an up and down career. I guess this is why people say, you know, you have to really love it to be an actor. You can be in Singapore one minute and then sitting in your flat on your own the next minute. It's up and down, up and down, up and down. You have to be really mentally strong to cope with that. I don't know how strong I am. I guess I'm getting pretty strong because I've been doing it for so long. But, but yeah, it's still tough. It's still tough. I hope you don't mind me talking about this. I think it's good that we talk about these things. Please comment below and let me know what is tough about the job you do or the studying you're doing. And just let me know. Let me know below. Let me know below. That is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Until next week, have a lovely, lovely week. I will see you then. Lots of love. Bye. Ding 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 